it's bad, isn't it? It's so bad. I am so sorry, guys. It's been like three weeks, man. Absolutely ridiculous. Three or four weeks since we put up our last video, man. And there is no excuse. The only thing we can do is blame it on coronavirus. We'll blame it on coronavirus. Don't worry, we're back. We're back and today we have another sick video but this video has literally been on the hard drive for the last three weeks i should have put it up ages ago so we kind of go back in time for this one this one was actually recorded just after lorenzo's birthday which was the first of march and we went over to center parks again to uh enjoy his birthday and celebrate his birthday and that so uh yeah don't forget to like and subscribe if you like these videos man and i hope you enjoy <coughs> what's going on Melo? nothing Pat. Yeah. I'm ready to go? Yeah, I'm ready. You ready? Yeah. Sienna, you ready? Yeah, I packed a little bit of chocolate. Packed a little bit of chocolate? Yeah, Listen, it's small, we haven't got much space in this car. Don't so worry, I hope it's you haven't bought too much things. Is it small? It's small. I've got my two shoes. Yeah. This one and that one. Yeah. And then I've got my phone in there. Yeah. My your phone. You mean your iPod touch? I mean, yeah. It's not whatever. a phone. You're whatever. Not okay. You're not ready for no, a phone yet. Shush. What do you mean, shush? Let me talk. Go on, do you think? And then I've got a little packet of Maltesers. Little packet of Maltesers. I bet it's a grab bag, a share bag. But it is. <laughs> and guys, as you can see, this actually isn't our car, is it? This is a carbon black X7, uh, and we have a great X7. Um, we went to BMW today, as Tara said earlier, because we had a problem with our chairs. Now, BMW have been very helpful and kind indeed to give us another car, basically, so we can continue our journeys and get there safely. Now, this X7 is a little bit different to our X7. Open the door here. Hello Lorenzo, what are you saying? <laughs> You're right. Hello Maya. Hi. Hello Nico. You're right. There's no rear screen entertainment and these guys moaned about it straight away. They noticed it straight away and they moaned. Can you believe it guys? They are moaning about that kind of thing. No. Wait, yeah. when I was younger, yeah. yeah, your age, not car my dad used to drive. Yeah. Uh, Do you know? The Christ, the Christ. No, no, he didn't have a PT Cruiser on your age. Mr. Mr. GTO. He, he had a Vauxhall Cavalier. Do you know what that is? I think I do. He the, had a bus. The, the long. Do you know what entertainment you had in that? What just a radio? A tape player and a radio. Mad. That's it. <laughs> and you lot like, are moaning about having no rear screen entertainment. It's absolutely it's crazy. Good. Guys, these kids just don't know how good they have things at the moment. They don't know how good. Anyways, let me show you the other differences about this car because I'm actually screwing that I'm not driving it all the way to center parks because this car has massage seats all right so that's set to level three and sienna can uh, you feel that that is, that is good I'm does it feel good it. i'm saying it's it. nice isn't it it's car. nice i've got it i can't believe it tara gets to drive in complete luxury but you have air you have air coming into your neck though this car has air seats as well still though. yeah so it's got it man. He driving are you coming in my car are you going with your man i'm going in your car you're going in my car yeah all right let's go man we don't need a stinking car anyway yeah car stinks yeah. Right, um, I'm all packed. Yep. Everything ready to go, so we're yeah. gonna make a move. You're carrying on yes, without me. Carrying on because without you. I can't leave yet because my clothes are still drying oh in the dryer. So I'm sorry, Sienna, we have to wait Do another jump on their roof? 45 minutes no, before we leave. On their roof. Jump on their roof. You couldn't even get up there anyway. I could. You couldn't get up there if you tried. I got no, you couldn't. Go on. Can I come here? <laughs> go on, do your thing. Hi. Go on. Go on, Spider Girl. I know, you gotta scratch your car. No, 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 leave it, leave it. All right then, so you're leaving now? Yes. All right then, I'm gonna leave probably about half an hour yeah, for my clothes to dry and stuff. Yeah, I'm hungry as yeah, well. Yeah, but I can't get something to eat as well. Yeah, we just, we'll just get them when we get there, and it's no point something together, because I have to wait for you. Really? You're not gonna catch me, oh. She lost any weight? difference. Has she lost any weight, guys? Yes, she has. Has she? Does she? I don't know. <laughs> Why are you doing that for? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's way. Just cuckoo crazy. You've lost weight. You, you don't need to lose no weight. You lost weight. No, I need to gain weight. You need to gain weight. You do need to gain weight. How <laughs> daddy lost weight? I ain't lost no weight. I put more weight on. Your mum's give me all the weight. <laughs> and look, my boot is almost totally full. And this boy had the cheek to put his big rucksack right in the middle yeah, there the where my suitcase is going to go. How dare you? You keep that on the lap, boy. Keep it on the lap. There's not enough space to put all this stuff in, man. We're struggling for space. What about me? The fact is, yeah, this boot is actually surprisingly big. He is quite big. It's, he like, is quite big. You got a push chair. But there's a push chair, guys. There is a push chair in the boot, and it's not an ordinary push chair either. It's a double push chair. I can one, fit in here. One for Tiago, one for Sienna. I can fit in here. <laughs> I'm only joking. Get in there, then. Go on. Go on. You actually sit there, though. Yeah, just about. <laughs> oh, the all right, let's lock him in there now, then. <laughs> so. We are here, we have arrived first. Everyone's just chilling in the hey. back. We're waiting for the ladies to come with the keys. Um, so yeah, my hair looks a hot mess. I got my new hair, but it needs to kind of like get used to my head. I need to like straighten it a bit better. But anyways, yes, um, we're waiting for the lady to come with the keys. 
are the fobs because it's fobs here not keys which is great because obviously you can use the same fobs when you go swimming you can put money on them so you can pay for things but yeah Nathan's probably about an hour away so we've got here at 20 past nine well we got here at like 10 past nine four uh, we got here about 10 past four um but yeah just driving around and driving down obviously you have to go really slowly blah 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 but yeah we're here i'm gonna uh show you what the tree house looks like even though you've seen it before i just want to show you anyway so this is the tree house guys it's exactly the same one as we stayed in last time for lorenzo's 10th birthday which is crazy um so yeah we're gonna go in we know exactly what it looks like on the inside but you know it's still nice it's still nice and obviously we have the other tree houses over there there's four tree houses in total there's one on the other side that way but yeah just waiting for the lady she needs to hurry up still want to go inside and have a cup of coffee i have just emptied all the food bags so we have an abundance amount of snacks here there is a shop here you can purchase stuff but we just prefer to bring stuff that we like from home because sometimes it can be quite a bit cheaper and not all the time do they have stuff that you want to have so we have some party rings a must uh not for me though these are my uh greys like protein nut power bags i just have some of these every now and again just to get me going some oranges we have the baby milk we have a like a complimentary hamper that you get so there's some things you get given so we've got some chips some bread some lemonade nathan loved this last time some jam some chutney some chocolate more chocolate some sugar and then we have chilling some uh lovely i think it's like a rose kind of prosecco and there's also another bottle in the fridge here and then over here you get some coffee and customer machine the rest of the stuff i brought those ones from last time this is stuff that i've brought some my muesli i always bring some flash wraps because i absolutely clean the whole place down beforehand because even though it's been cleaned you just never know people coronavirus is about so i make sure I clean everything down. I've already took some cokes out of there. And then we're gonna go to the fridge, which I have already added stuff to. This came with us. No, this came already in here, should I say. Brought this with us. We have the lactose milk and I have the almond milk, unsweetened, obviously. Some chocolate for the kids. You get loads of cheese when you come. So there's brie. I think this is more brie. Oh, that's blue cheese, so that's brie and then some uh, strong cheddar. I brought the Cokes. These are Nathan's Old Malt. Some yogurt, some uh, sausages and bacon for breakfast. These automatically came uh, in the fridge. And then we have some of Lorenzo's, uh, Tiago's Innocent Smoothies, some apple squash, fruit shoots and juice. Pot noodles, this is a quick snack just in case. Haven't added anything to the freezer, but there's a bag of ice in there already. Um, but yes, and there's more stuff in the games room and there was loads of chocolate on the table. But as you can tell, they've already got into it. And these are the toys that come in here, which needs to go back in here. These kids already starting me off. Was it you that was stealing all the chocolate? You wanna go outside? Have they already left you? Soraya and Lorenzo have left him. Let me quickly take you outside. Oh, out. Yeah. Careful. I'm oh, coming, Tello. He's okay. He's in his walker, guys. He can't get to anything. Quickly. Across a little bridge. <laughs> Into the games room. Use that left Tiago back. Oh, he didn't want to, he wants to stay in here. Maya, can you quickly go in there to Marcelo while the show? Go on. Good girl. So guys, in the games room where Lorenzo is already playing pool, we have this huge, when I mean huge, I mean humongous TV. Um, we have this pad here, the controls in here as well, the lights, music, sound. I think we have an Xbox 360, no, Xbox, what we got? Xbox One in here. Um, that's the one that had a PlayStation, but I think Lorenzo's brought more stuff. We have a nice sofa, and over here we have a fridge full of beverages. We have some Copperberg, Coke, Sprite, beer, lemonade, some water, some more wine, guys. And we have another bottle of wine over here as well. And some popcorn and some glasses. And I think in here there's some games as well. Yep, there we go. Dominoes, chess, Scrabble, all that stuff. This is a chill vacation. This is a relaxed one. This is not 
out the house every two minutes. When you have a tree house, you have to make the most of it and you have to stay and utilise the space that you've paid for. Tiago is walking around with an Xbox controller. I do not know why. But yes, guys, them games in that cupboard, we'll be using the most of those. We'll be playing those games because we'll go out to have dinner and go swimming and whatnot. I'm probably doing a couple of activities, but this one is a proper chill one. We've literally not long come back from Centre Parks and last time it was quite busy. We did quite a lot. We had friends with us. It was really fun. And really, really good to have people with us. But we can just chill now, ain't it? Yeah. We can just chill. Even though they was going to come back with us again, but they didn't come this time, unfortunately. But we'll still have fun, won't we, Buggy? Yeah. yeah. So Tiago's over the hair. Mashing down uh, the pool table. But we're just waiting for the lot to come, man. We need to hurry up. Hurry up, Nathan. Hurry up. Mm, enjoy your food. Yep, it was nice. nice. Got hot wings. Yeah, hot wings. You and love hot wings. Add a little bit of good from your dual burger. My leftovers. Couldn't eat it, man. Dry burger. Man. It was nice. Though. You liked it. It was all right. Now, quick question for you guys here: When you come to a service station and you finish your food, like we have here, do you a take it to the bins yourself and tidy up, or b leave everything on the table, walk out, go straight back to the car? Leave everything on the table. That's what I would do. What do you do? Leave everything on the table. But where do you get that from? Because I've never done that in my life. First of all, you know what? Because some of the stuff won't drop when you go in, and I don't want to walk and go all the way to the you bin. Mean, you want to be lazy, you know what it is. And I don't want to drop all the That's food. Lazy I don't want to drop it. It's lazy. Not my phone. Listen, Mom I... and Dad, Mummy usually does it. <laughs> well, today you're going to pick it up and you're going to put it in the bin. No, I'm not. Why? And no, that's, what, that's what we always do. No, I think it's wrong to leave it on the table. I don't know why. Even though the people are paid to clear it up. I don't know. Am I wrong or am I right? Oh my gosh. What a long journey, man. Oh, 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 guys, three hours later, almost now, nah, two hours, 45 minutes later, and we are finally at Centre Parks. We're at the tree house again. Them guys are probably chilled or settled in, probably in their pajamas, probably already in the hot tub, to be honest, man. But let's see what they're doing, man. Let's go and see exactly what they're doing. Oh, it's a long walk, man, but you know what? Because I've been driving for so long, I actually do not mind this walk at all whatsoever. My legs are so cramped up in that car. In the middle. I need toilet. You need toilet? Yeah. My legs are stiff on that, man. Yeah. I swear down. Do you mean your car? What my do you mean? are all the way up to the dashboard. No, they're not. Yeah. This geese is going like it's 7 4 or something. Oh my god, they're here. Yes, we are here. Yay! Finally. I oh, know, yeah. Finally. Finally. I was recording. Here. Oh, would you? So you would have just seen that already. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> You're right. Yeah. Hey, Bog. Hey, that was creepy. You're right. Yeah. In the pajamas. I just said, I bet you any money, yeah, they'd be in the pajamas. Where's Soraya? Yeah. Maya, are you in pajamas? No, I've got to show you Oh, yes, you are? Yeah, you've got to see the jacuzzi. I've just, just showed crazy. I've just showed these out on the camera on my phone. Yeah. Come, let me show you. All right, cool. Let me go outside and see what oh, this big deal is. Oh, the tree house is so nice. Obviously, guys, we'll give you another tour after. That's it. Do you know what? I want to be around a bit. I know exactly. They've seen it before a million yeah. times. They've come here all the time. Stand back. Let me show. I want to show. Uh, let me see what this is. Stand back. Stand back. Stand back. Stand back. I bet it's something back. absolutely minor. I bet you it is, guys. Oh, what? Right. Pull, on. Pull it. Pull it back. Quick. Right. You ready? I'm ready. This is normal, isn't it? That's normal. Look. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. It's not that bubbly. It's ain't that it's bubbly. Really? What's going on? Screwing. Oh yes. Look at that. Thank you. A proper, proper hot tub. Oh. Madam. Thank you very much. About time, about time. Shut it down on man, I don't want to waste out all the bubbles and stuff. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. Hello Tiago! Van Lig! You're right! They could be been crying, you're right. What's that? Chocolate. Chocolate. Um, Mum when they gave us mm. their names on it. Oh yeah. That one there. That chocolate. You know what, yeah? The lady who let us in. Yeah. Same lady from last time. Oh, yeah. Yeah. She's coming down. She's like, oh my gosh. She yeah. said, her friend, the next day we put the video up, phoned yeah. her at seven o'clock in the morning. Yeah, 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 yeah. And was like, was taking a kid in the treehouse. Oh, She's yeah. like, was who? <laughs> what? When? Yeah. She's like, yeah, I had yeah. no idea. She said, you're on the video. Really? She's taking a kid in the treehouse. He's in the treehouse. Her kid was going is. crazy. Yeah. So she sent out the video. She watched it. She said, it was absolutely amazing. She tells everybody about the video. Yeah. So they yeah. talk about it all day. They've come back. She's going to sing your name down there. She's like, no I was way. super hyped Serious. to come down and let these guys back in. <laughs> Nothing. Nathan. Do you know what I mean? Nathan. All that talk, but no discounts. Nathan. Feel no. me, I'm not interested. No discount, I want discount, I don't Nathan. care. We don't come in here. She's happy we carry the bags in and everything. Yeah, nah. Yes, and she still. also validated my uh, vouchers yeah. that I've run expired. Oh, she really? put them back into date for me. Okay. So thank you very much for that. Oh, they're okay. okay. That's decent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah that's decent. So, yeah, that yeah, is a discount. There you go. That is a discount. Fair enough, fair enough. But yeah, she she let us in and she was hyped about that. So yeah, she said she couldn't believe it. Yeah, that is crazy. That is crazy. The video is the best video she's seen about Santa Park as well. I'm serious. So much you know what? It's so mad. Lively. It's mad because you never know who's actually watching the video. I know it's crazy. That's the mad thing about yep. it. Hello, hello. I ain't seen him since morning. Hello, baby. You really a good boy. 
Oh, apparently he was crying all the way in the car and stuff. <laughs> They've had to stop off and that. He's a naughty boy. Before, he was perfect. He wouldn't have cried at all or anything like that. Now, he's growing up, man. I'm telling you, he's growing up. And he's about to start crying, I think, in a minute. Been waiting for this all day. Finally, it's drink time. Adult time. I'm gonna pop this complimentary bottle. <laughs> I don't know what, I've actually opened a bottle of like fizzy, sparkling water before um, like this with a cork whilst I was uh, doing my health and social care course and I didn't look when I was doing I was talking and it shut out put me right in my eye had to have my contact lens out and everything literally I was so lucky I could have gone blind but so lucky well here we go ready? three, two. Oh yeah! Way. Finally she did it right. Yeah. So we've all just come out of the hot tub. We had dinner and then we all had a little bit of a chill out. So now I'm just relaxing, reading a magazine, uh, Home and Garden, I'm trying to get some inspo. Want to do the house up nicer very soon. Oh. Gonna do the extension. So getting some inspiration over here. Got Tiago sitting down with me. We've lit the fire. It's perfect, chilled, Ow. relaxed. Marcelo is asleep and the twins are here in their robes eating yogurts. Muller Corners, what more could you want guys? And I've just poured myself a nice big glass of Diet Coke. And we are gonna resume the vlog tomorrow guys, so we'll catch you in the morning. See you in a bit. Good morning everyone. And it's the second day at Centre Parks. Well, can't even really call it the second day because we got to Centre Parks so late yesterday that we can't really count yesterday as a full day. But we are beginning today at Centre Parks as our first day at Centre Parks. First thing we're going to do is uh, we're going to get the bikes for the kids. Every time we come to Centre Parks, we get the kids bikes and stuff. The kids love bikes. Except for Maya. Sarah doesn't really like bikes at all. She likes to walk with the mum uh, whilst the mum pushes a pushchair and stuff like that. So it'll be me, Romello, uh, Lorenzo and Sienna who actually gets bikes today. Then, once we've got the bikes, I think we're going to go and get something to eat from. There's a pancake house, basically. It's all right, and that kids love it. I don't know why. I don't know. I just have a traditional, normal breakfast, but they want to have pancakes uh, for breakfast and stuff. But they don't just do sweet pancakes. They do savoury pancakes as well. They do like um, like a full a full breakfast uh, pancake. It's got like beans and like mushrooms and things like that. So if we end up going there, I'll probably have that uh, for my breakfast. Um, what are we doing after that? Uh, I think then we're gonna play some badminton. Yeah, that's right, some badminton. Uh, there was one challenge me said that I can't play badminton and that so I'll probably get a few wins in here and there um, After that probably play some table tennis and we're just gonna see where the day takes us from there But um, I'm just about to get washed and dressed. I say washed and dressed. I'm wearing this t-shirt anyway today um, <laughs> I'm about to get washed off uh, and I'm gonna head downstairs see what everybody else is up to. Tiago! Tiago! Yeah! Look up! Hello Van Leek! You up, right, mate? Hello! Hello! I'm coming downstairs now. Hello Soraya! Good morning. Good morning. I don't know. Trust myself here, man. I swear, man. I really don't. I'm right on the edge. Who else can I see? I can see Marcelo. Marcelo. Well, I can see the mum as well. Hello. Hello. Marcelo. Can you see me? I don't think he knows who you are. You can't see me, can you? No. Hello. Hey. Hello. Ah, you can't see me. Look. 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 Hey, hey. Marcelo. 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 Hello, Smokit. Hello. Hello. And we come down the deep, twisty stairs, man. And I'm scared of these stairs because they're rock solid and if you fall, it's getting over. Hey, Lorenzo, what's yeah. going on? What are you up to? Playing Dragon Ball Z? Yeah. Action figures in the morning? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. we got to pump your ball up today, don't we? Yes. Yes. That's why we I need to find a pump to pump your ball up. Yeah. You know what I mean? Your yeah. freestyle ball so we can play some football. Without it, we ain't got no ball. So we'll do that after we get the bikes, yeah? Yeah. I've told them about the plan today. They already okay. know what's happening today. Yeah. Obviously, we're going to go and get the bikes and stuff. Yes. Get some breakfast. Yes. In it. And then, uh, yeah. badminton probably. Exercise. Exercise. Yes. Hello. Hello. Tree house. Tree house. We're in the tree house, mate. We're in the tree house. Yeah. Probably go for a uh, pancake house for like mid afternoon. Yeah. Mid afternoon. Because, like get them some like pancakes and waffles and whatnot. Bumble I think we for breakfast. No, he's going cafe rouge. Oh, cafe rouge. Oh, yeah. For breakfast. Cafe rouge. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I would prefer cafe rouge. And then obviously pancake house is more of a lunchtime oh, yeah, kind of snacky yeah, place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought so. so. We'll do that I thought after, you don't want to go there for breakfast. After badminton and that, we'll go there. Yeah, after. we'll do that. Yeah. We'll do that. Hello, Sayo. Say that it's all just milk. Hello, Sayo. Hello. Hey. 
Oh, he's getting big now, man. Sitting up on his arm. Can wave. Oh, he's grown up so fast. So it's crazy. He's Too so fast. clever as well. It's scary. Should it be Thiago? Thiago is really clever, but Marcelo. Yeah, yeah, he's even yeah. cleverer. I know, yeah. It's a man. <laughs> what are you doing, Thiago? What is he doing? <laughs> what do you guys want to do? What's around this holiday? Um, I want to. Get, a hair, get your hair done, yeah? That's yeah. the first thing. <laughs> what? I want to, what do I want to do? I want to... You want to play uh, pool? You want to do archery? Oh, yeah. I know, you want to go roller skating? Yeah. You want to do roller skating, innit? Every time we come here, they do roller skating. What do you want to do, Sienna? Roller skating. What do you mean, roller skating? Oh, oh, oh. What do you mean, watch roller skating? Yeah. I want to do... I want to go to the park. The park? So yeah. boring. You go to the park. No, yeah, we will go to the park. You can do that anytime. No, because the children go outside and they go flying in there. Hello. Yeah. Back again, Tiago. What do you want to do? Come here. Treehouse. Treehouse. I. Oh, he's not. I don't know what you're trying to say. He wants to go in the games room, which is in that other building over there. You want to go in the games room? Yeah. And do what? Play. Do you want to play? Yeah. yeah so it's time to get washed and i brought my little pack here with me of course guys when you come to these kind of places they provide you with like some soap some shampoo and some body wash and that kind of stuff there but that is never ever going to be good enough man and plus i'm scared to use these things most of the time because i i don't want to come out in like no rash or anything like that I'm not saying it's going to make me have a rash but i just don't trust anything that i haven't bought myself so here is what i bring with me every time we leave the house and we stop somewhere uh, first thing is, I bring some uh, some 360 styling gel. I can never ever get it to work though. I don't know why. For some reason, I don't know if I'm doing it wrong or right, but my hair just doesn't react to it at all. It just doesn't do anything at all. And I've been using it for ages, so I ain't gonna be getting no waves anytime soon. <laughs> Next thing I bring is some aftershave. Um, I bring two aftershave always. So one uh, is Creed and the second one is this Valentino one and I'm telling you guys this smells so good it is unbelievable it is so so good I got this from Tara for my birthday uh, it came with a in a pack with this and uh, some shampoo as well I haven't bought the shampoo with me today actually no it's not shampoo it's body wash this and some body wash but I've, I've only bought the uh, aftershave today and um, what else have I got here some toothpaste obviously oral B so that will go there um, beard oil now I didn't know, I know this is gonna sound stupid, yeah. I did not know, yeah, that you could get oil just for beards until about a year and a bit ago. No word of a lie. So I was just putting in like the same stuff I put in my hair in the beard. But this one is Tom Ford, man, and it smells so good. It's so good, no word of a lie. Keeps your beard looking nice and shiny and stuff, and it smells unbelievable. So that is a must as well. Then we've got Tom Ford Exfoliate. That's right, this is good for like the skin basically, it just like it cleans out the pores in your skin and that, so it's supposed to make your face look a bit clearer. Uh, so that is also a must as well. And last but not least, we have a brush, obviously, to comb my hair. Uh, and that's it, basically guys. That is everything that I bring with me when we come away from the house. So I'm about to hit the shower and uh, check this out guys. I absolutely love this man. You got one of these shower heads here, uh, that ones that you can just move around yourself just like that and then you also have these jets here they all shoot hot water into you as well it feels so good and it doesn't stop there either guys because if you look up you've got that how nice is that and you look to the right and you've got the whole forest feel going on in the shower it's absolutely sensational guys so i'm gonna hit the shower now man and uh i'm gonna meet everybody else downstairs in about half an hour <laughs> And I can honestly say it's a much better day today than it has been recently when we've gone to Centre Parks. It's not raining, it's not freezing cold. Isn't it Sienna? Is it alright down there? Yeah. Yeah. Under there. Underwear? Under there. What's under there? Um, nothing. Nothing, go on then. Venus, Venus. Yeah, I'm going to show him, I'm going to show him. Okay. Alright. I can this. That's decent. Do you know what? I don't know why I bought. Why do I not feel safe under here? I don't know what it is. Hi, so you kids will just run anywhere and not even think about the consequences. But well, this is crazy. We're actually underneath the treehouse right now. How mad is that? Tig, Tig. Too slow, Tila. Too slow. <laughs> Look at these two chilling like villains. Tree, can you see the trees? There's loads of trees. Tiago's got a snack tray. And he's juicy and Marcelo over there is chilling watching yeah watching Tiago's biscuits 
Guys, food. you can probably hear like a roaring noise about going. Actually, you may not. Is it like but there's a um, an army base just behind these trees, and last night bear fighter jets were being let off. Really? So much so, yeah, that I had to look online just to make sure nothing weren't popping off. And basically, they were doing a nighttime flying exercise, so that's why like eight or nine jets just shut off. It's crazy, and it's so loud. Yeah, yeah, there's an American army base actually in the same base the as the UK one, and also they've got the African section as well. Wait, okay. Killing it! Yeah. So, this is the only thing about where you stay in the treehouse. They isolate it from everywhere else, so you're like away, more away from like these little accommodations. It's down a massive slope, so you have to walk up this crazy hill every single time. But you know what? It's nice to be away, it's all the way down there. It's the only actually tree houses that are really away from everywhere else because um, the ones in Woburn are quite close to, um, to the actual beach area. Could be a good thing, mm, it depends, but we like this one here. Guys, over here, yeah, it's called the drop. They blow this massive thing up, yeah, and you jump from there. Would you do it? If you would do that, like this video. Let's see how many people would actually attempt to jump off there onto this when it's blown off. I would do it. You would do it. Well, make yeah, sure you I like the video. Know. If you would do it, make sure you like. Right, it is lunchtime and we are not having Pancake House and I'm so glad. So uh, yeah, we're at Cafe Rouge right now. It's all like steaks and stuff though. I'm not really keen on steaks in that, man. Have, like, um, what? Did I do what? Do you know, do I feel like wraps or burgers? I don't even know if I feel like that. Do you know what? I don't want to eat too heavy. Do you want baguettes and that? Nah. Do you know what? I fancy a bit of fish, you know? I really do. Yeah, I fancy a bit of fish. I'm going to get the salmon, I think. Salmon. The potatoes. I don't want to eat too heavy at this time, if you know what I mean. Because we're going to go and play some sports and that now. And I don't want to feel all sluggish and stuff. Do you fish Somewhere down there. Yeah, I'm going to go for that. So I've ordered my food guys, which is a char grilled chicken baguette with salad, yeah. Have a guess how much this cost. Have a guess. Maybe three seconds. Three, two, one. £12.45. <laughs> £12.45 for this. No word of a lie. And you've got the salmon, yeah? Yeah. How much is that? I think it was about like £14. £14. I don't care if it's gold. That's crazy. It's just ridiculous, Top on 45 guys. But uh, yeah, we're gonna eat this. Everyone's eating their food and that. We're gonna eat this and we're gonna get out of here, isn't it? Tiago. Tiago and Marcelo are gonna be so close. Literally, Marcelo loves him. Finds him so hilarious. You see, give him a song, Tiago. Old old. This kid, yeah, is still obsessed with that old time roll song. Honest to God, I've never known anything like it. So we are just gonna order their desserts. They've had chocolate brand and ice cream and then we're gonna head into the sports centre. So we'll resume the vlog over there. See you in a sec. Oh my God. Yeah. Do you know what? I'm playing and holding the camera at the same time, guys. You ready? Ready for this? Hey! See, one-handed, you know. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go, people. Here we go. Mommy's the best. All right, everyone's got their bikes. Seven fun new bikes. Okay, we're gonna do a speed test. All right, we're gonna see who's the fastest on their bikes. Now, we all know that Melo has an electric bike. Oh, yeah. So, Melo, we're gonna disengage yeah. the electric function. How do I do this now? Yeah, I'll do it. I'll do it, I'll do it. I don't trust you, mate. Eco. There you got eco. Okay. Off. Oh. So yours is off, there's no excuses. Okay. okay, and then, basically, the thing that's down there is gonna tell you how fast you go past. So I'm gonna make my way down there now, yeah? yeah. And then Sarah's gonna go first, Sienna's gonna go second, Lorenzo third, and Melo last. I'm carrying you more weight. Got you got more weight, carrying. you get more momentum going down. Yeah? Uh, all right. <laughs> all right, so Maya is first. She's pulling as fast as you can, Maya! As fast as you can! Quick, quick! 10! Sarah's got 10. All right, Maya, that's decent. All right, who's next? Sienna, off you go, quickly. Come on. Keep going, keep going. <laughs> oh, she's got 10 as well. Oh. <laughs> you got 10, Sienna. Lorenzo, off you go. Fast as you can. Quick, 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 quick. Quick. That was fast. All right, that was 15. I missed it, you said 15. You sure? 15. All right, last but not least, Romello. Fast as you can. Oh. 
Oh no! 18! I seen that, that was 18. Man, I won that. 18 is decent. I know. Uh, Why is it not fair? He's got a lecture bike. It's fair, perfectly fair. Okay, they've done the bikes and now they have decided to try and run and break the speed limit. So, let's see if they're fast enough to run faster than 10 miles an hour. Okay, go, 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 go. 13, well done. <laughs> so, Angan, you trying to tell me, yeah, you ran faster than you rolled? Yeah. Is that what <laughs> That's crazy. 12. Only one mile per hour faster than Snook it. <laughs> Is it accurate? It's not accurate, is it? No. <laughs> it's, it's not accurate. Oh. All right. Off you go. Go. Man, what's right? Ah, nothing. You got to do it again, mate. Yeah. <laughs> he's gonna moan and say he's tired. Watch. You got to do it again. Okay. Yeah. Why? Because he didn't say it. he didn't oh. read anything. I must have been too quick. Ah, oh, duh. <laughs> <laughs> Did it? Oh, that was a nine. No, that was a nine. <laughs> nine. That's a nine. That's poor, man. You're trying to tell me Sienna's faster than you. She, you got a nine. This face property. What do you mean? This property. What do you mean? You got a nine. Nah. You're the slowest out of three. Not accurate. <laughs> Not accurate. Go on, man. Go on, man. Oh, she got ten. <laughs> Romano. Might be you. <laughs> Should I beat you? I knew you went that quick. I told you, didn't I? I told you that. What? You too tall? What? Huh? No, I seen it. It flashed. It flashed nine. It did. It flashed nine. Might be you in the race there. That is terrible. What are you saying? You too tall? I'm too quick or too tall. Too quick or too tall? Yeah, one of the ones. Got beat by Maya. Let's get back quick call. <laughs> so it's been about three weeks, guys, since we've been back from Center Parks. And we are stuck in the house just like you guys, man. It's so boring, it's unbelievable with this coronavirus stuff, man. There's no football, there's no football training, the shops are not open. It's just absolutely boring. So, because of that, we're gonna make sure that we're putting on videos. Not every day. I'm not even going to say every day. I'm not going to get hyped like that. But uh, yeah, we're going to put loads of videos. So make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Turn notifications on. And we will be back probably tomorrow, man. In a bit.